Hello everybody and welcome to a new session of Auto 13 customization with no code. In this session we are going to do something useful for those who are not familiar with coding and have no time to learn um, you know, coding. And even if you are not interested, you are just an, an implementer and you want to add a few fields with no need to hire a new developer. So let's go here um, in this view and what I'm going to do right now will be applied for any form of view. So I'm going to um, view fields to add a new field. I will name it new date. And of course the label will be new date 2. I will keep it with a symbol the field type like date. And of course you are you know you are free to select another one here we are we can make it required or we can keep it you know optional you can also make it read only but of course I need to play with it a little bit so I will copy this field here and I will save it so actually we have this new field added here in this view I will reload and go to edit view form most of us if needed to uh, modify the form of view will play with this um, form of view but we also know that if for any reason you wanted to restart your server update your module you will lose all the changes you already made so the new thing here that you will go to form view and add new form for new date field and here we are I'm, go I'm going to do right now is to play with XPath which stands for XML path. Here you will add expression where you will define how to find you know the field or the element you want to work with. In this case I'm, I'm targeting the field with attribute name and this attribute will have the value payment term ID okay and here we are i'm sorry uh, okay it should be ready so the position where i'm going to work and it's relative to this this element it will be after so i'm going to add a new field with new name and this is the field i just created save and close and save and here we are I think we are ready to add a new field here and payment term ID this is a field I used in XPath and you can check it again so by reloading I already have new date and if I uh, it's required as you can see I can play with it and save it and it will work as expected just like adding a new field with the new module you know so even if you will try to restart the whole service and updating the module seal you will keep your own changes and um, I'm keeping the logging the logs here to check if it will also you know upgrade the module seal and now it's working on this you know it's upgrading the modules and it will not touch you with changes because you already have another view um, you know created in edit form view here and inherited and it will be there for new modifications so now you already learned how to add a new field with you know simple steps and it's easy just like using studio and enterprise version thank you for your time